What up, what up, what up, Night Nation? It's your boy, Stevie Knight. About to get on one of these things, you feel me? What's good with the watch? Night's watch shit, man. Marshall Monday shit, you know what I'm saying? Mondays, we give that motherfucking Eminem his roses. You know what I'm talking about? I was trying to, you know, figure out what I was post. Well, I'm trying to figure out what I was going to post for uh, Monday. And then, uh, uh, 8 Mile scenes came across my feed, you know what I'm saying? I'm just, you know, diving into it, you know what I'm saying? So it, got, it just got my attention. And then, you know, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm watching a little bit, and I'm like, you know what? I'm going to pause this shit, and then we just going to fucking ride this thing out and see what comes from it, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm, like, connecting dots right now with what I think was taking place throughout the uh, filming of the of 8 Mile, like the, 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 the battle rap scenes, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's like, did Eminem write it? Did he freestyle it? I'm hearing like differing. I'm hearing differing stories from people that you know, were were a part of that uh, film. You know what I'm saying? Got Anthony Mackie's interview up. He's talking about fucking uh, filming the movie and the Marv one. You know what I'm saying? A lot of y'all may have seen the reaction I did to Marv One on a Math Hopper's podcast. I'm gonna bring that shit up real quick, man, because I just think it's, it was, I just think it's interesting. You know what I mean, so I don't know what's gonna happen with this fucking video. Like, if, it's, if it turns out cool, I post it. If not, then I wasted my time. But not really, because I, I want to see this shit. But anyway, man, we out here grinding the grow, growing the ground all the time. Night Nation, nice watch, love y'all, man. Uh. Keep the Patreon, subscribe star, you know what I'm saying? Extra shit, extracurricular shit, bonus shit, you know what I'm saying? If you know, you know, you know what I'm saying? If you think my sign up, go ahead and sign up. I mean, if you've been there, thank you for staying there. Uh, merch, shopstevenight.com. If you woke, I am asleep. <laughs> you know what I mean? And, uh, let's do it. So what do I want to start with? Yeah, I'm going to pull up a little. I don't know, bro. We're going to just ride this shit out, man. Yeah, some of y'all may remember this. I'm gonna I'm a just, I'm gonna post this. I'm gonna uh, watch a little bit of this to just refresh y'all's memory. And refresh mine as well. Because I'm trying to like, put the story together for like, how the eight mile battles uh, took place. I'm gonna tell you why it's some sucker shit. It's some sucker shit. Cause what it was, I literally had spit. That was one of, that was around our era where you had verses in a clip. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You did. So it was like, yo, you in a battle? All right. Yeah, like it it wasn't it wasn't about who was the best. It was like, all right, who's gonna stop? Who's gonna stop? Right. So that was one of my verses. You know, spit the verse. It, was, it got more of a reaction than he wanted. Right. And what people don't know is that <laughs> what people don't know is that he was rapping when that beat came on. Like he was rapping, but the mic was off. Because remember, they cut the mic off. Right. It was like, yo, like no, he not rapping. Yep. His voice was messed up. Yeah, his voice, his the voice whole, was The messed whole up. shit, he was drinking honey the whole time, like, doing those last few scenes just because his voice was out. That's how I, I never saw nobody, like, I had never learned. That's how I learned to drink honey if you losing Tea your voice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like, he was just straight honey. That's so, the main Marvel, like, instant legend. So the, yeah. so the beat drops. Right. So the beat drops, and he's rapping, but nobody hears it. And I'm, I'm, I'm trying not to break character, but I'm like, God damn. Man, for real? Like, and look, I never forget. He's flipping his mic, and he says, "Oh, I got something for your fat ass, Mark." He did. <laughs> he's like, I got something for your fat ass, Mark. and he raps. And I turn, and I'm like, "Yo, you can't let me have this. Like, you can't let me have this moment." <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck? Yeah. He raps. I beat him. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> he raps. He rapped. Yo, Ed, you heard it? Nah, I, I want to watch. See, all right, I want to watch the fucking battle he's talking about. Y'all ready for death? Y'all ready for death? Come on, I'm the fat killer. The game that got ugly. Let's go. Yo. Yo, I seen your type before. You think you're tough. Battle you. Bitch, you lucky I don't beat you up. In the game of fist to cuffs, I push your face back. You can't fuck with me, man. Really, just face back. That you versus me in a battle of ten rounds is like Muggsy Bowles trying to walk with Jim Brown. Don't fuck. I'm the type to run the mark. Come in the club drunk as fuck. Slap your bitch so we can fuck. When I'm walking, I'm a man besides the dead Theodore trying to take his ear off. Like Mike Tice, I'm quite nice on fight night. Man, why he popping shit, man? I thought he liked life. Apparently not. I make O'Hare and he hot. And if I miss you, then your parents will be shot. 
go. I'm a bad boy, bitch is on. I put 44s on your chest like you break my own. Everything went according to plan during the first battle, but things changed when Marshall won the coin toss and had the opportunity to go second. We have it. Let's go. 30 seconds. DJ, spin that sound. The crowd began to taunt him. Hey, 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 this is lit. This is lit. The context means everything, bro. The context means everything, bro. Eminem does not fucking play. This is, hey, it's goat shit, bro. It's goat shit, dog. This is hard. My bad. I'm screaming in the motherfucking mic. This is lit. This is lit. Hold on, faggot. Hold on, faggot. Let me turn this mic on. Don't think for a minute I'ma let you get away with that song. That shit was whack. You ain't spitting. As a matter of fact, all of that shit was, was written, written. <laughs> off the top. Off the top. Let's go, dog. You ain't spitting. Mmm, mm, my bad, my bad. This is this got me hyped, bro. Turn this mic on. Don't think for a minute I'ma let you get away with that song. That shit was whack. You ain't spitting. As a matter of fact, all of that shit was written. <laughs> And I know it wasn't for me, surely. You really must adore me. Now look it. Yo, you might as well move to Italy. Look, this guy's ripped. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> you don't wanna really fuck with this. On this microphone, I'm not stuffing up with this, but I don't give a fuck. You can keep that dope rap and turn your ass back around with your fucking skull cap and your bandana or your motherfucking sweatband. Fuck it with the style, you're a dead man. I ain't red man, but on this mic, yo, I pick it up. Just like your face when I have to rip it up. You don't want to see me. Yo. Yo. But see, I see, I see, I see what Marv means when he said he won. Because this shit was written. Eminem's off the top, so I gotta give it to fucking Eminem because off the top. Bruh, but at the end of the day, like, Eminem's a fucking pit bull, bruh. He's a pit bull, dog. And it, it just, it, it means everything, bro. But when we talk about, like, this gold conversation and, like, the, criti the, the, the criticism that Eminem receives throughout his career, you know what I'm saying? Because, y'all know, I ain't wanna take it there, bro. But, like, shit like that, like, these other tangible, skills that Eminem has and like his just tenacious attitude towards hip hop bro like he don't gotta do that he could be out here just writing he could be out here just writing mainstream ass records you know what I'm saying just fucking songs for the radio that's not him like he's a fucking hip hop legend hip hop historian hip hop student and he's a fucking pit bull bro he's like hey you're not gonna come up here you're not gonna come up with, you're not gonna come up here on my motherfucking shit and try to disrespect me. Not disrespect. You're not gonna take the, uh, the attention away from me, bro. They was they was they was clapping way too hard, dog. Eminem said, "Turn this fucking mic on. Turn this fucking mic on, bro. Like I lost my fucking voice. It don't fucking matter. You're not about you're not about to make me look bad in Detroit. You know what I'm saying? Eminem called that shit out. That shit was written. My shit off the top. That's why I gotta make you drop right now, goddamn. That shit was hard. That shit was tough, bro. Um, and then oh, fuck. I low key just wanna ride through all the fucking." Eight Mile uh, hip hop scenes, man. But it was something else I was fucking watching. Eight Mile. Uh, what's your favorite Eminem story from favorite Marshall Mathers story from that set, Anthony? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> there was uh, there was this one day we're sitting on set, and uh, Eminem comes over and he's like, "Yo, what's up, man?" I was like, "Hey, what up, Em?" So he's like, "Cool, cool." So you know. I was reading the script and I was kind of thinking like, there's no reason for me not to like you. Like you're a cool dude. Like I like you. I was like, I like you too. He's like, cool. So you don't mind if I like add some stuff in the script about you? I was like, well, about me or about the character? He's like, no, no, no. Just add some stuff in the script. Like, you know, just side character stuff. I'm like, yeah, no problem. So <laughs> he goes and his entire battle, the final rap, he Googles me and, like, learns about me and all this stuff. And he basically, like, makes fun of me as Papa Doc. <laughs> and I'm like, well, that's a little too personal there, uh, Mr. Marshall. 
and and it and it stuck in the movie. It stuck. Yeah, it, 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 his whole final battle. I'm like, yeah, well, yeah. I mean, yeah. I grew up in a nice house, and yeah, my parents they were nice to me. Why? <laughs> why are you poking fun of me? <laughs> <laughs> so what happened when uh, when 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 uh, Cut got called? What happened? What happened? Yeah, he just he literally walked over and was like, "Yo, that's gonna be dope." Like, yeah, yeah, that's, that's that's gonna be great for you. That's, I'm happy for you. I'll just stand over here with look and let that pass. And so your reaction on camera was that your first initial reaction that was kept as well in eight Yeah, Ma? yeah. There was nothing. Else. I mean, what else? So I go to Curtis and I'm like, Yo, Curtis, what would be good is if he do his rap, then I do a rap and it's a tie, and then he does another rap and I don't say nothing. I was like, But I gotta say something. He's like. No, no, I think it'll work better if <laughs> says and you don't say anything. Like, so I don't get to say nothing. I get no nothing. I just stand there. He's like, yep. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh, man. I did not know that. That is amazing. Yeah, it was pretty. You're the first person I've told that story. I did not. I, I will take that exclusive and run with it because that, <laughs> that is amazing. That gives me a whole new pers- I, Like, now I want to go see it again. That's, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Now That's tough. Yeah, we got to do it. We got to. We got to. Yeah, fuck it. We're gonna just we're gonna run through every fucking uh, battle scene on fucking Eight Mile. Cause yeah, this is this is this was a good idea. Hold on, hold on, let's do it. All right, speed it up a little bit, Abe. Come on, baby. All right, look, yo, yo. Your style is generic. Mine's authentic made. I roll like a renegade. Uni clinic aid. My technique's bizarre and ill. I scar and kill. You were a star until I served you like a bar and grill. Cause I proceed to cook and grill ya. That's all it took to kill ya. You better recognize me like I look familiar. You wanna battle? You beat around the bush like you're scared to lick pussy so you eat around the tush. I need a clown to push. Someone that I can bully. Wait a minute. I don't think you understand fully. fully. See me without a style's like mustard without the Heinz. I lead the new school. You're a buster without the, the rhymes. rhymes. I crush the shit out your line. Now I'm the dark shiki smoking that lick licky. Hidden freaky girls inside that gin tiki. Girl, when you see me, you better believe me. This ain't a game and pimping ain't easy. <laughs> Look at y'all standing out here freezing like dumb fucks. Rapping and waiting for food off this raggedy lunch truck. Who want what? Who pumped up to get rolled up? <laughs> I spit venom in it. <laughs> Bro, I used to have braids, dog. You know, I played ball. Everybody used to call me fucking exhibit, dog. Everybody used to call me fucking exhibit, bro. <laughs> they were like, what up, X? I used to hate that shit. <laughs> but I see it. Bet y'all see it now, bro. I get that. But man, I hate this shit to make about me. My bad. But that makes me also think of the shit I get called to. I get called every fucking day. It's not like a week goes by that I run into a stranger to say, you know what? You look like a... Uh, Spawn, you look like uh, 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 what's what he playing? Um, Bones or whatever. But I always hear I look like Michael J. White too. I hear that all the fucking time. Anyway, back to Eminem. Food off this raggedy lunch truck. Who want what? Who pumped up to get rolled up? I spit venom in every direction. Soak some up. Look at this fat ass nigga. <laughs> Sloppy sucker. You an ugly motherfucker. Your pop should have wore rubber. Stop rhyming. Keep your day job, Vanessa. Next time, leave that bullshit home on the dresser. Speaking of dresses, take a look at Bar the Fruitcake. When you travel, you probably pack panties in your suitcase. Made out of lace from Victoria's Secret. If 10 men came in a cup, you probably drink it. Oh. Okay, folks, enough of the gay jokes, especially from a gay broke bitch yourself. Hey, Lo. <laughs> Doo-doo. Fuck? You've worked here longer than me, and I get paid more than you do. Serious, man. Dog, take a seat. What's this guy standing in line for? He ain't got money to eat. <laughs> check this out. Yo, yo. This guy cashed his whole check and bought one ho-ho. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking homo, oh, little nice. maggot. You can't hack it. Paul's gay. You're a faggot. <laughs> At least he admits it. <laughs> Don't even risk it. This guy's starving to death. Someone get him a biscuit. <laughs> I don't know what they told you, Mike. You must have them cornrows rolled too tight. tight. His job, you want to quit, but you can't. You worked at this plant so long, you're a plant. <laughs> Look at your goddamn boots. For Christ's sakes, they're starting to grow roots. <laughs> On this mic, you get faded. 
You look like a pissed off rapper who never made it. Mm. Oh. And why you fucking with the gay guy, G? When really you're the one who's got the HIV. Oh. Man, I'm done with this clown. He's soft. Ooh. Fuck it. I'll let homegirl finish you off. <laughs> Yo, this guy's a choke artist. You catch a bad one, you better off shooting yourself with Papa Doc's handgun. Climbing up this mountain, you're weak. I leave you lost without a paddle, floating shit's creep. You ain't Detroit, I'm the D. You the new kid on the block, about to get slapped back to the boondock. Fucking Nazi, your squad ain't your type. Take some real advice and form a group with vanilla ice. And what I tell you, you better use it. This guy's a hillbilly, this ain't Willie Nelson music. Train the trash, I took you to your last rep and have you looking foolish like Cheddar Bob when he shot himself. Silly rabbit, I know why they call you that Cause you follow future Like you got carrots up his ass crack And when you act it up That's when you got jacked up And that's stupid like Tina Turner When she got smacked up I crack your shoulder blade You'll get dropped so hard That Elvis will start turning in his grave I don't know why they let you out in the dark You need to take your white ass back Across eight miles to the trailer park This guy raps like his parents jerked him He sounds like Eric Sermon The generic version this whole crowd looks suspicious. It's all dudes in here, except for these bitches. Mm. So I'm a German. Yeah, man. fuck you. Look at that. It's so hard for me to take him serious as like a gangster because we know how he is in real, real life. You know what I'm saying? He's like a upbeat chipper guy, but I remember how the energy he had in this movie, like the fucking little, the whole thug image, bruh. It's funny to see that. Bitches, it's all dudes in here, except, except for these bitches. bitches. Oh, so I'm a German, eh? That's okay. You look like a fucking worm with brains. Yeah. Proof. Free world rookies. Lucky. Pocket six dicks be pussy. Mm. Talking about six creek. Bitch, you could be a piss creek with paddles. This, this deep is still gonna sink. You're in disgrace. Yeah, they call me rabbit. This is a turtle race. You can't get with me spitting this shit. Wiggity, lickity, shot. The spooky, spiggity, split, lickity. So I'ma turn around with a great smile and walk my white ass back and forth. Oh, no. I'll spit a racial slur, honky sue me. This shit is a whole thing. Like, oh, fuck. I, I think I, I remember. I think I read something. Y'all correct me if I'm wrong, but did Eminem write the raps for these rappers? He did he write everybody's verse? I remember reading something about that. But then it's like I heard shit about him saying he freestyled every fucking thing. So I don't know what it is, but I'm I'm here. I want I want to you know what I'm saying run through all these battles, but I want to see the shit. Well, he wrote. He just said Max said he wrote it. You know what I mean? He said, Eminem just said to Mac that he wrote a verse to him, but talking about, like, Mackie's actual life. So, yeah, just answer my own question. So, I, th I think it's just sprinkled with fucking written and freestyles, because Eminem clearly fucking freestyled against Marv 1. I'll spit a racial slur, honky sue me. This shit is a horror flick, but a black guy doesn't die in this movie. Mm. Fucking with my old dog, you got that makes me believe you really don't have an interest in living. You think these niggas gonna feel the shit you say? I got a better chance joining the KKK. Or some real shit though, I like you. That's why I didn't wanna have to be the one you commit suicide to. Fuck power, call me your leader. I feel bad that I gotta murder that dude from Leave it to Beaver. I used to like that show. Now you got me to fight back though. But oh well, you gotta go, then you gotta go. I hate to do this. I would love for this shit to last, so I'll take pictures of my rear end so you won't forget my ass. And all's well that ends okay, so I'll end this shit for the fuck you and have a nice day. Lord, I think you were a little hard on the beaver. So was Eddie Haskell, Wally, and Miss Cleaver. This guy keeps screaming, he's paranoid. Quick, someone get his ass another steroid. Last round, me head, pay attention. You're saying the same shit that he said. Matter of fact, dog, here's a pencil. Go home, write some shit, make it suspenseful, and don't come back until something don't hit you. Fuck it. You can take the mic home with you. Looking like a cyclone hit you. Tank top screaming, Lotto, I don't fit you. You see how far the white jokes get you. Boys like, I vanilla ice gonna diss you. My motto, fuck Lotto. I'll get the seven digits from your mother for a dollar tomorrow. This is hard. 
Who goes first? This is hard. Let that bitch go first. <laughs> oh, <laughs> bro, I can't take him serious. I can't take him serious, bro. <laughs> Let that bitch go first. That's, it's funny, bro. Who goes first? Let that, Let that bitch, bitch go first. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I can't believe my ears. How the hell spell it? Pumping a lot of anger. All right, all right. Papa all right. Doc. Hey, check this out. We got new rules. We got new rules. Being a championship round, each of these cats, they get a minute and a half a piece. I don't know what's going to happen. You ready? You know what to do? DJ, kick that shit. Call him Uncle Tom. Uh, I am white. I am a fucking bum. I do live in a trailer with my mom. My boy future is an Uncle Tom. <laughs> I do got a dumb friend named Cheddar Bob who shoots himself in his leg with his own gun. I did get jumped by all six of you chumps. And we did fuck my girl. I'm still standing here screaming, fuck the free world. Don't never try to judge me, dude. You don't know what the fuck I've been through. Fire. I know something about you. You went to Cranbrook, that's a private school. What's the matter, dog? You embarrassed? This guy's a gangster? His real name is Clarence. And Clarence lives at home with both parents. And Clarence's parents have a real good marriage. <laughs> that's, that's fire, because all this shit is like facts about Anthony Mack. That's hard, bro. That's hard, dog. What's the matter, dog? You embarrassed? This guy's a gangster? His real name is Clarence. Clarence. And Clarence lives at home with both parents. And Clarence's parents have a real, real good, good marriage. marriage. This guy don't want to battle, he shook, cause ain't no such things as that way crook. He's scared to death, he's scared to look at his fucking yearbook. Fuck Grand Brook. Bro, that's so hard because, damn, that's lit as shit. That's lit as shit. Because, like, before I was, before, before I became, like, thoroughly submerged in this Eminem shit, I do... What I remember the most from 8 Mile is how, like, you know, how Eminem just shitted on himself in a battle and pretty much took all the ammunition away from fucking Papa Doc where he couldn't do shit. I mean, that's what I remember. Like, he, Eminem shitted on himself, put it all out there, and Papa Doc was useless at that point because anything he said was not going to hit. You know what I mean? But then it's like, it's, a, it's like a double because, like, Eminem admitting admitting all that shit to the fucking crowd, saying like, "Bro, I'm from the slums and shit. Pretty much, I'm from here, but I'm here, I'm this shit for real. You pretend to be the way that you are. You know what I'm saying? Like being vulnerable to the audience and like letting everybody see is one thing, and then taking ammunition away from Papa Doc is one thing. But then Eminem is you know providing that relatability between him and the audience and showcasing the Papa Doc is a fucking halfway crook. Like, bro, you're not really that. You're not really that. You don't really live this life. You know what I'm saying? Like, you, you portray this fucking thug image. It's not really you. You know what I'm saying? You came from a fucking two-parent household, but that's a double because he's playing on Anthony Mack's real life, bro. Like, that's hard, bro. That's fucking hard, dog. Shit. Shit. That, that's it, right? Ain't no more rapping? Fuck a beat. I go a cappella. Fuck a Papa Doc, fuck a clock, fuck a trailer, fuck everybody. Fuck y'all if you got me. I'm a piece of fucking white trash, I say it proudly. And fuck this battle, I don't wanna win, I'm Audi. Here, tell these people something they don't know, know about, about me. me. Bitch. 
a rap. It's a rap. You can't say nothing. 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 Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. That's hard. I low key want to go back and watch this whole goddamn movie. Nope. Nope. And then, isn't this like the same shit that happened to fucking B Rabbit before, early in the movie? Like they played the beat and he was just quiet. It's like full circle, right? That's hard. No. Nope. 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 Ah, <laughs> uh, that's tough, bro. That's tough. That was a good idea. That was a good idea. I like that. <laughs> Had a good time with that one, man. Yo, um, yeah, I'm gonna watch this. I'm gonna watch the whole shit. I'm gonna watch that whole shit, man. That's why Eminem is the GOAT, bro. Shit like this is the reason why motherfuckers put his ass up there, bro. Like, he don't gotta do that. He don't gotta do that. You know what I mean? Anyway, definitely, definitely, definitely fire. Definitely fire, man. Um, Y'all add some more context in the fucking comments. Let me know what the fuck I missed. Some facts you may think that I don't know to, you know, fill in more of the fucking puzzle piece for me. You know what I'm saying? But giving this shit more context, it means everything. You know what I'm saying? It's, 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 it's fire, bro. It's fire. Anyway, we out here grinding the grow, growing the ground all the time. Night Nation, Night's Watch. Love y'all. Peace.